hi guys welcome back to my channel so today i'm going to be showing you my dressing room slash office and giving you a tour and also revealing my gallery wall which i'm so excited to show you so if you're interested to see it then just continue to watch That's what I like about you. Welcome, my name is Juliet, and I do three videos a week on all sorts. I do lots of beauty, fashion, and lifestyle, loads of different things over on this channel. So if that's the kind of thing you're interested in and you enjoy this video, there is a little subscribe button down there in red somewhere. I would honestly love for you to click that and stick around. It's completely free and entirely up to you. But without further ado, let's get into today's video. So before we go into the tour, today is really exciting for me because today's video is actually a collaboration with Decenio. Oh my gosh. Since I started YouTube, I've watched videos that have collaborated with this brand and I literally was so, so excited when they contacted me. Although I haven't been paid for this video, they have gifted me the pictures and the frames. They gave me a small budget to show you guys what you can do. So Decenio are a Swedish brand that actually supply a whole variety of prints. I was shocked at how much variety they actually had and I was interested to know that they actually update their website quite regularly. So there is literally something for everybody on their website. Me and Matt spent a whole week on this website using their gallery wall feature that they have which is absolutely amazing where you can pick your prints and you can put them into like a gallery wall simulator so you can see what they would actually look like on your wall. There was filters so you could filter by different themes or different colors or different rooms and I just was I was honestly blown away by how technological this website was um god i sound old i wanted to do a gallery wall in this room and i've been wanting to do it for a long time but i just could not think about what to do and so it took me ages to pick it but i'm so so proud of it and i cannot wait to show you and also an amazing thing to add is that i have a discount code for you as well so i will be leaving a discount code and a link in the description box below which is mrs dudley that is going to give you 25% off. That is going to be valid from today, so the 13th until the 16th of April. So make sure you make the most of that code. It's going to be 25% off prints only, so it doesn't work on frames or hand-picked or personalised prints. Let me tell you now, there are so many prints to pick from and the prices are so so reasonable. With the budget that they gave me to buy my prints, I bought eight prints for in here, three for in the living room and two for in the kitchen and I couldn't believe how far the money went and so if I was spending my own money I would be so so happy with that. I cannot pick a fault with anything so I'm going to show you us unboxing them, I'm going to show you me putting them on the wall and then I'm also going to be showing you the tour of the rest of my dressing room. So I really hope you enjoy this video, let's get into it. Okay so this parcel has just arrived so I'm going to get it open and see what's inside. Okay, so that is how it's packaged. It's got all my frames in and my prints. The frames look beautiful. This is how they've arrived. They've got protective film on the front and it's a nice, they're nice thick, deep frames. So these have been bought for this wall in here that I have been waiting to dress for so long. If you follow my channel, you will know that I've, this wall has been playing for a long time because I really haven't known what to put on there. So for this wall, I've got six 21 by 30 frames. So two 30 by 40 frames. And they're all in gold because I just really wanted to just set the pictures off as well. So they have all come in a further protected booklet. Opening the black box that comes inside here, are my prints so this is a large one to go into my living room this is a 50 by 70 print which is beautiful the paper is really you can hear it really thick quality just pop that down there and then these are the prints that are to go inside my picture frame so i'm not going to show you them all i'm going to put them all in the frames and then show you what they look like on the wall i love how these clips work because you know on certain frames you've got those little metal things that you pull back and they have a tendency to snap off these have really good heavy duty clips on the back to keep your print in place isn't that stunning so excited to see the way It's got 
kind of crowded here, but I know you see me too. Everybody's singing, oh, everybody's singing, oh. I don't know what it is about you. It must be in the way you move. Just say you want me to. We got nothing to lose. You're looking so old. Baby, let me love you, let me love you, let me love you, let me love you. Baby, let me love you, let me love you, let me love, let me love. Baby, let me love you. Okay, so this is as you walk in, and this is my dressing room and slash office. This is what I want to speak to you mostly about. I've been wanting to know what to do with this wall for so long because I wanted to keep it plain in here and white, but I wanted to put something on this wall. So this is what I went with. So I went with this flower in the window. I love this one. This is probably my favorite one, this like dress and shoes. And then I wanted to put a little bit of beauty in. So I've got the makeup brush up there and the little perfume bottle the lips and then i just loved this flower too and i really wanted to incorporate some really like inspirational quotes so i had this one here which is she designed a life she loved and then over here this one which says beauty begins the moment you decide to be yourself absolutely in love with them i just can't get over how beautiful they are i really think it sets off this room now so that is my decennio wall so the other prints i'll show you when they're up in the house um a couple as i showed you were for my living room which isn't started yet because of all the situation at the moment and also for my kitchen but this was the majority of the prints and yeah i'm in love with them let me know what you think which one's your favorite so as we come over here this is like my work area so this is a loft a door up to the loft it's absolutely rammed full of crap in there stairs up to the loft which we eventually was going to we're going to convert but we just don't know what we're doing as of yet um this clock is from the range i think it was just like six or seven pounds moving over to my desk area so this is my pride my mac um i nearly had a heart attack the day i bought that because they're not cheap i absolutely love it it works really well for my youtube and also i do wedding photography so it's good to have the big screen underneath here i've got two sets of alex drawers so i have one facing that way and then one over here facing this way and we kind of made shift this desk so we just bought these acrylic legs off amazon and then this worktop is actually from ikea and we cut it down to make a desktop here and then we use the other two to make shelves up here because i just really wanted the marble kind of theme going through i'm really happy with how that turned out and then the little bits in here so this is from b and um, yeah i love to have just like a little quote on there believe in yourself and you'll be unstoppable it is definitely a motto of mine these flowers are actually a mixture of different bunches from home bargains these come in one bunch these are another bunch and i think the roses are separate as well um, but when i made this so i made this letter j which is actually i did a video on this actually so i will leave that linked but when i created that i had loads of flowers left over so i put them all together and put them in this little mason jar which was i believe also from home bargains so yeah i love that that stays there all the time and then these are a real recent purchase these drawers are from primark they were just 10 pounds and i love these and i use these to keep in all like my hard drives and all my memory cards and everything so they these were originally to go in the living room but i just put them there and i love them and they come in really useful so that is where they have stayed so moving up here to the shelf area like i said i did um make that so i'll leave that link below this candle is from primark 
and this gold vase is also from Primark and the plant inside is from Primark and then the other half of this is like a gold stand which is up there and that's got that Ikea plant in so these are really popular you've probably seen these loads on social media that is from Ikea and then I like to keep it nice and plain in here but I do have things like my mic for recording voiceovers and then a few notebooks and stuff up there so I like to keep it very plain white gold pops of pink um, underneath got a couple of little baskets these are two for a pound from Poundland um, and then a nice little pink box I think I got that from look fantastic actually and then moving over here this like little space just keeps my notebooks in I'll also briefly tell you about these chairs because these chairs were an absolute bargain so I actually bought these from eBay and they were only I think I paid £10 a chair and they were actually red I'll see if I can insert a picture like on the screen but these were red and the cushions themselves were a really horrible like orangey colour and I think they came from like a restaurant they were brand new but they were from a restaurant and we ordered eight of them so they are actually the dining chairs but I bought them upstairs because I recovered them so I just painted this with white satin wood and then this I just bought some material off eBay some crushed velvet and I did all the chairs in that colour and I just love them. I've got one in this room, one in my bedroom and then the six chairs downstairs as well. So I try to keep everything away because this is a dressing room as well. So I have all my like everyday electrics in there, hair dryer, battery charger for my toothbrushes and things like that and I just like to keep them so that you can't see them. I really hate wires so I tend to keep everything neat and tidy away in there. This little orchid was all also from I want to say Ikea actually I think it was and this just goes pride of place on here and then this neck curtain was also from Ikea so I didn't want any curtains in here I wanted it really nice and bright because I've got a beautiful view out the front with like cherry blossoms and stuff so I just wanted to keep this room nice and light and these neck curtains are so cheap and affordable leave them linked below anyway if I can see them I know that Ikea is closed at the moment but this is just one of the pair and then it's just tied back with a hair clip but yeah I just love the look that this gives in that window I just really do love that um the only thing I hate in this room is this printer but I do use it a lot so that is the only place I can put it at the moment so that it doesn't look too bad and then over to my mirror wardrobe doors so these have been built in for years now I will leave my wardrobe decluttering below um, because I go through everything in detail loads of people asked where these boxes were from they're actually from Matalan and um, so I've got the little um, smaller boxes and then over here these are the bigger boxes down there so yeah these i think were only about five pounds each so so useful and then these little labels i actually bought the brass ones off amazon and then just put what's in there in them um the actual inserts of this wardrobe so all like these shelving units and everything is also ikea and i think the hangers are from I want to say eBay um, I bought too many <laughs> I've got so many up there but I just wanted them all to match like I say I will leave my decluttering below because I went through the whole of what is in my wardrobe and things but I'm so so happy with how it turned out moving over to this side so this is Matt's wardrobes now ignore the fact that I have actually got to do one more coat of paint on that door that's the only thing left to be done in this room so these wardrobes are also ikea they are pax wardrobes so they are the full height of the room and we had mirror doors on one and plain doors on the other Matt has these wardrobes his wardrobes are also really nice and organized he's got the drawers on the bottom and shelves on the top i mary condo everything even matte stuff so it is all nice and neat it's just something i love to do i love to have the neatness in wardrobes i just really do it just makes me feel so much better so my rug was actually from a shop in birmingham um if i can find them i will link it below i think i paid only about 100 pounds for it which is really quite cheap because of how thick pile it is it was originally bought for my living room 
and it just looked so pink in the living room it just did not look right so we moved it in here and i love it against the cream carpet i just really really do so it's found a new home in here and i love to sit on the floor in here it is probably one of my favorite things to do is probably sit in this bedroom on the floor because it's just so comfortable and um, so yeah if you ever need me i will probably more than likely be in this bedroom <laughs> so that's it guys i really hope you enjoyed this video as i said there are going to be more room tours coming because i know people do want to have a nosy which is absolutely fine so i'm going to be doing a room at a time don't forget to head over to decenio i will leave my link below and it is 25 percent off from today which is the 13th until the 16th of April. So until then, you're gonna be able to get 25% off all prints. So it doesn't include frames and personalized or hand-picked prints, but all of the other prints you get 25% off. And oh my gosh, guys, you wait till you head over and see the variety they have. But yeah, I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and I would love for you to subscribe and stick around. And until next time, guys, take care. Bye.